Hello, welcome back to Starving for Attention, the show where we put things inside our butts and they slowly get bigger every time. Today we're talking about clubbing and um, just partying and going out. And I don't want to sound like a Andrew Tate stan fanboy, but, you know, I, I like doing it. I don't like doing it, but it just costs a lot of money. And the thing about it isn't like... I'm not trying to say, don't do it, it's, it's fucking, you should be grinding instead, you should, you should be hustling, like, fuck off, Are you, fuck off, like, no, partying is good, going out is good, it's fun, but, obviously not all the time, obviously not every weekend, it's, you gotta like, you know, <clears throat> control yourself. I get if you're in, like, a normal full-time job and you want to go out every weekend, that makes sense. But if you're not, what's the point in going out every weekend? You don't have, like, a horrible job that you need to, like, forget that you have. I love my job. I work at a supermarket, and it's easy as fuck. I have nothing to complain about, apart from, obviously, some of the customers. But I'm not even going to be in customer service soon. We're going to restart this, um, not recording, but we're going to rest. we're going to fucking do it again. Clubbing and party, or partying not so much, but going out to nightclubs and clubbing is fucking expensive. They're just trying to steal all your money because they know you're drunk and you're going to spend your money on more alcohol because you want to get more drunk. So every fucking drink costs like 20 bucks. It's fucking insane for one drink. It's not even like, most of it's not even like alcohol. It's just 20 bucks for one cup of Jackson Coke. Well, it's not 20 bucks, it's like $15, but still. And like, when I go out, I go to this club called Paramount. And this other one, my favorite one is called Magnet House. Magnet House, you get a... Uh, if you ask for a Jack Daniels, they'll give you a, a bottle, a pre-mixed bottle of it. And it's... You can get a four-pack of those exact same bottles for 20 bucks. But one bottle there is $15. Like, how much fucking money do you want? Imagine how much money they're making. People, The same people go there every fucking weekend and buy the same... Sometimes on Friday and Saturday. And buy the same shit... And there's like fifteen dollars a bottle. Um, I, I can imagine they're drinking like ten bottles at least, or ten drinks at least. That's like a lot of fucking money. That's over a hundred bucks every time I go out. I spend at least two hundred dollars, at least. And I don't drink that much. Like I don't. It doesn't take me that much to get drunk. I'm a fucking lightweight. But it's still like you know. Expensive as fuck. They're just trying to steal your money. And I'm going to sound like a conspiracy theorist again. But holy shit. I want to keep my money. I like money. Everyone likes money. <clears throat> but everyone likes fucking spending money. As well. I. Like saving money. And I like making money. And obviously I love spending money on stupid shit. I'm going to go buy some fucking Batman costume after this. But. That's for a YouTube video and for making shorts. And I know that in the last video, I just complained about, like, Instagram Reels and TikTok and shorts. I didn't talk about the side where I make them. And I uh, think it's funny to make them. Because it is. It's fun. It's funny. I enjoy doing it. And obviously it's like a, a, a way to get more views. But, like, come on. Come on. Come on, man. The thing about making them is... Actually, we're not even going to talk about it because we're going to be complaining about clubbing. Partying is different. Partying is like you go to your friend's house, you buy like a six-pack and drink that and get fucked up. Or you, you're you like me and you try and save money, so you buy a ten-pack of Summer's Bees. They taste like shit, but there's ten of them and it's only 20 bucks. It's $26 for a ten-pack and that costs... That's cheaper than two bottles at the club. It's like, holy shit. You get ten... Ten... <coughs> you get ten... Um... 
bottles, you get 10 cans for $26 at the bottle O, or you get a two glasses of Jack Daniels at the club. Obviously, it's going to be better to go partying. And, like, people like going clubbing to meet people. Most people go clubbing so they can um, get chicks really drunk and fuck them. But, you know, the only time it works is at clubs because they're way too drunk to see what you look like. Because most of the dudes there are ugly as fuck. I'm not gay, I'm just, I just know that. I just, I just know. Trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me. And, um, yeah. Most of the people that go there are ugly. All the chicks that go there are ugly. Well, they're not. Uh, oh. There's, uh, most of them are ugly. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna get... Fuck off. I don't have any gun ammo. I, I mean, gut. I don't have any ammo. Why is the box always hidden behind so many fucking doors? How am I meant to get to it? Can I buy this? Thank you. The Olympia. Bang. Bang. Now I gotta reload it again. Um, what was I talking about? Ugly people at the clubs. Yes. Um, the first time I went with my friend Towns, he pulled a fat chick. And it, um, uh, I didn't call the fat chick it. I, fuck. <laughs> um, she followed us basically back to the train station and was trying to go to my friend's house. She was trying to get on the train and go to Towns' house. Like, he, what the fuck? What the fuck? He, now, like, it's a, it's a thing, like, my, I have a clothing brand called Goblet, and he was wearing that at the time, so now it's a thing. If you want to pull fat chicks, go buy some Goblet merch. But, um, uh, I have a shirt coming that stops that from happening. It's just a shirt with the, the no alcohol if you're pregnant logo on it, and it says no fat chicks, and then it says in the front, Goblet does not condone the fat... Do, Goblet does not condone the act of fat chicks hitting on dudes at the club. And obviously, it's a very fucking offensive shirt for fat people. Fat chicks. It would be funny. It would be funny if fat chicks started wearing it. Because, like, that exact shirt. It would be pretty funny. Hold on, I need a drink. What was I actually talking about? Clubbing, 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 clubbing. The music! Every fucking weekend, it's the same. They play the same music. It's so shit. Every fucking time you go out, it's exactly the same. I don't know how people do it every weekend. It's the same. All the fucking time. It's like I'm stuck in a loop. I go to work. I go clubbing. I get hungover. I go to work. It's like, what the fuck? And, like, I don't have any money. I'm not saving any money because I'm spending it all at the clubs. Like, holy shit. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Where's the box? Where's the box? It's not there. It's that way. Fuck off. I need one more kill. Thank you. Now I'm going to have no money when I get back here. Yeah, but it's the same music every fucking time. <clears throat> like, to get them to play a different song, you have to go up to the DJ and hold your phone there and put on a band or, like, put on an artist on the phone, in notes, and screenshot it and zoom into it, so they can actually see it. Oh my god. Fuck off. Leave me alone. They, like, real. I, I listen to punk, so I barely ever get my songs that I like played on the thing, unless it's like pop punk. The only time they ever played it is like, I had to go tell them to play Blink-182, and they, it was the last song. It was the last song they played, and then the club closed. The last song. Are you fucking kidding me? The last one? Usually the last one's good. At a concert. Not at a fucking club. Like, they were playing the song while people were leaving. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? It's like, are you kidding me? Like, what the fuck? And they would play, like, Green Day sometimes. Or, like, Good Charlotte. Or, like, fucking... No, that's literally it. They... they... They've, I think they haven't, they haven't played Simple Plan once. You know the, I'm just a kid and life is a nightmare. Like, you'd think they'd play that song. You'd think they would play that song at the club. But no. They haven't. I have not, well, they probably fucking have, but I haven't heard it. Out of, like, the couple of times I've been there. I've been, why did I pause it? I've been, like, 
Probably. Oh my god. Fuck. What the fuck? They're jumping from the sky. They're falling. It's raining. Fucking beat people. Um. Um. Oh, give me this fucking. Oh, f what are you doing? It's meant to aim for me, but it's not. Shit. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck you. Fuck off. Oh my god. Yeah, but the fir the only couple times I've been there, I've been there probably like seven or I know probably ten times now. They play the same fucking songs every week. They play the same fuck. The same people are there. The same clubs are there. It's not the same people. It's the same type of people. It's so shit. Like you go to the clubs and like you know you go there to get drunk and you go there to party. Yes, they are two things that I fucking enjoy, but not with, like, the, the, the only thing I don't like about it is the fact that I waste money. I'm going to be completely honest, the only thing I don't like about clubbing is the fact that it costs so much fucking money. If it was cheaper, there's obviously clubs that are cheaper, that have cheaper drinks, but, like, I'm not going to go to a club where no one is, and the only reason they're getting people in is because the cheap, the drinks are cheap. Like, I'm not doing that. It's... Uh, I don't know. The only thing I don't like about it is that there's no money. That, that it wastes all my money. And it's fucking shit. Because it's the same songs. That's that's kind of the main thing. The, the money and the songs. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Quick revive. I need this. Why am I shorter? Yeah, um... Just... Clubbing is a waste of money. It's just go get drunk in a park with your friends. Go buy a bag of goon for like $15 and drink it with your friends. But I don't like goon. I'd rather drink fucking hand sanitizer, which is vodka. And so would my friends. So if you don't like goon, which goon is is like a bag of wine. It's it's not gooning like like the goon patrol, the goon squad, the fucking dick thing you do with your dick. It's um it's a bag of wine, and it's called a goon sack, and you, it's cheap as fuck, it gets you drunk, and, um, the only time I've ever really gotten drunk off it was, what the fuck is, oh, I thought that was like a zombie, I was like, hold on, it was at a party that I, um, regret, so, oh, actually no, it was, it was a good party, it's just, I, I was talking to someone I didn't want to talk to, that, like, while I was sober, I didn't want to talk to, but when I was drunk, I was... All over them. So yeah, go get drunk at a park with your friends. It's better than clubbing. You have better memories with your friends than at the club with a bunch of strangers. So this has been um, what is your show called again? Starving for attention. Thank you for watching. Go watch this video up here where I talk about um, going shopping as a as a kid, going shopping with your with your dad. And how cool it used to be, maybe. I don't know if I'll make an actual, actual video, make like a 